Welcome back. We have some special friends with us here. We have uh, Matt from our very own from Dell Technologies yep. and our very special guest here, Ian from Red Hat. Happy to have you guys here. Now, uh, Matt, uh, Paul, and Ian Pilcher are with us to discuss how to simplify the management of containerized workloads and, uh, and cloud, uh, cloud native apps as well, right? Across That's your right. entire multi-cloud landscape. Uh, and as you guys saw, there was a really cool keynote this morning. Uh, so it's really nice to have you guys. How are you doing? I'm doing well, thank you. All right. Yeah, nice doing great, to glad to be here. Now, hey, really nice to have you guys here. We don't have a ton of time, so let's just get into it. Ian, can you tell us a little bit about Red Hat at its core? Basically, you know, what are you guys trying to achieve? What's, what's so, going on? Yeah, absolutely. So for, for those who have followed the industry for a few years, you'll know of Red Hat probably from our, you know, our product, Red Hat Enterprise Linux. That's historically where Red Hat came from, you know, with a strong belief in open source. Mm -hmm. um, but we've also, for the last 10, maybe even more years, been talking about this vision of ours of the open hybrid cloud, um, which is to leverage the, the cloud, the technologies that the cloud providers have, have brought to market and that cloud experience that people love, but to allow people to take advantage of that in a way that does not tie them to any specific implementation, any specific cloud, or really actually even being in a public cloud provider. So the hybrid cloud includes not only the public cloud providers in the classical sense, but on-prem, private clouds, um, all the way out now even to edge devices. You like to democratize across the board if you can, right? Any yeah. application, yeah. any time, any place, any platform. Good stuff. Did you have a, something you were gonna say on that, Matt? <laughs> no, I mean, in terms of the intro on, on yeah. Red Hat, I think that's spot on. You think right? that's right on? Yeah. Key, key, right on. Now, what are you hearing from customers? What's the feedback like? Um, I'm sure there's probably some challenges as well, right, in that environment? Sure, absolutely. So customers love the hybrid, or the, the public cloud experience. Mm -hmm. um, but there are also things about the public cloud that they don't always like. They don't, mm -hmm. they don't always like the bills right. that they get at that's the true. end of the month. Um, they also don't like the, the loss of control that comes with it sometimes, data sovereignty issues, et cetera. They're confronting the reality that there are certain things that just can't move there or, or run are best run you know, in their own data center. And that's before we even get into all this edge stuff. Oh yeah, you know. yeah. oh yeah. Yeah, so, and I, I, I agree. I think the couple other things that we've been talking a lot about is, you know, um, customers in terms of complications and how things go in terms of the problems they're seeing. How do we make things a little bit easier for them? Um, especially when you think about this new multi-cloud world we were, we're all talking about. And what does that mean in terms of multiple vendors, multiple players on each side? And at the end of the day, customers just want those outcomes. And how do we, together as a partner, right deliver those outcomes for our customers to make sure they can actually get to the business of, of running their businesses as opposed to worrying about IT. Yeah. It's so crazy. I remember when everyone was debating like, is public cloud even a viable you know, technology? Yeah. Yeah. And now you're like, which one? Or all of them? Yeah. It's like, exactly. wow, Excellent. how yes. fast, we, how far we've come so fast. Now today with big announcements, obviously we've announced you know, Dell Epic's uh, cloud platform for Red Hat OpenShift. Mm -hmm. Can you talk to us a little bit about how that kind of addresses some of those challenges that are out there and that we're all working on to solve for our customers? Absolutely, so you know, all of, the, all of the various cloud providers and the various platforms we've talked about bring their own capabilities to the table. And what customers in our experience are really looking for is a common platform, if you will, on which they can deploy their workloads, manage their workloads, you know, using the same code, same management tools, et cetera, across all these various platforms. And for Red Hat, that is OpenShift. That is our, you know, our cloud platform, if you will, or our cloud operating system. And by partnering with Dell, um, on the Apex Cloud Platform, we are dramatically easing the path for customers to implement that in their data centers on premises, um, on, on bare metal. Yeah. That's the pain. It, it's exactly. Yeah, always I think good. when we, in addition, when we think about um, the product, you know, the, the, the cloud console that we're working together on, um, 
we think about day zero operations, day two operations, and we're really innovating from the Dell perspective in terms of what does that look like when it shows up at the customer site? How do we create an integrated experience? And then when you think about once it gets up and installed and configured really easily, um, well, what about the second day? And what about right. day in? And, yeah. and we've done a lot of really good work here about you know leveraging integration into the cloud console, I mean, into the, the OpenShift console, the web right. console. And so customers get to manage how they're used to managing, right? So they're used to managing in this console, and so now Dell is integrating all our goodness inside of that, so they can do some really cool stuff like end-to-end -end lifecycle management with a few clicks right from that console. And so the idea is to get customers in a position where they don't have to worry about all this other stuff, they just can, like I said earlier, they can get to the business of running their apps, running their, uh, apps that they need right. to run to be successful. It, it's really, it's, it's all about time to value. Um, so as where previously, um, many, you know, you could have always run OpenShift on premises, lots of customers do, but it's a bit of a project, you know, and for a lot of organizations, it's very difficult to find the, the time, the resources to free up to implement that, you know, whereas now they can do it very quickly, very easily, and, and get started right away, you know, utilizing the platform. Yeah, I love that. And as, as we speak, I can hear the band warming up in the background on the side. You hear that? They're ready Maybe to it's party. giving you just a little bit of emphasis, right? Yeah. It's like, yeah, like, wouldn't that be yeah. nice to have a little guitar rock every time you say something cool? Uh, for both you guys, how are Dell and Red Hat both promoting this open ecosystem, right, in the context of multi-cloud? Um, you know, I know, obviously, Michael Dell has a full-throated support, and, uh, and that trickles all the way through the company, obviously. Uh, but what do you guys think? How, how, uh, how, how is the, the partnership collaborating on this? So, I mean, Red Hat and Dell have been partnering for darn near a quarter century That's now, right. depending, on, depending on how you count. It's, 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 it's actually amazing to, to think that it's, it's that far, that's been going on for that long. But Red Hat, of course, is, is all about open. You know, we've, we've always been about, about the open source, um, open standards, open platforms, and it's great to have Dell, you know, working with us yeah, on that. I agree. Uh, when we think about open here, we think about with, with Dell, our software-defined storage, it's all PowerFlex shared Ooh, yeah. as well, right? So oh, yeah. we think about being able to run that you know, in all the different data centers. We think about being able to run that in all the multi-clouds and working together, partnering that with, with uh, Red Hat, you know, how does that look and how can we make that successful? And then in the other piece in terms of open is the foundation software that we're creating. Mm. So within the Dell ecosystem and with the Red Hat ecosystem, ensuring that integration is solid so uh, when customers buy the platforms and align the platforms, they know they'll have support for this ecosystem today, the ecosystem tomorrow, and all the multiple clouds moving forward. Well said, Matt. Really cool stuff. Well said. Do you have any final thoughts at all, Ian? No, I just think it's it's incredibly exciting um, with today's announcement and really looking forward yeah. to seeing where we'll this goes. We'll see stuff here with this guy. We'll see, we, man. We're going to do a lot of good stuff coming forward, and we're excited to give it to the customers. Nice, Absolutely. man. And so is the band. They're yes, ready for they're it. Jamming. All right. <laughs> a little Terminator theme going <laughs> yeah, on. Yeah, it now. is. It's <laughs> wild. Well, hey, thanks so much for joining us, uh, everyone around the world watching. We appreciate you, and we will be right back. Cheers.